All right, welcome to agriscaping.com. So this is Tasty Tuesday. I'm Justin Roner with a nice crew of people that we have here. I'm going to start first with Lon Schaefer. She's the Empress of the Universe here in the agriscaping world. Remember that. <laughs> <laughs> Our life would be much better if you remember that. <laughs> so this is kind of a fun thing that she invented. We call it the Eat, Grow, Share. And so we do this, uh, we used to do it all the time. We're doing it a little bit more. We're starting doing it a little bit more, right? We, we will, but when you come back, when we, when I'm come not back. going into your station wagon and trying to cook out the road, <laughs> I'm telling you that. Okay, fair enough. So, tell us about what what uh, what this is when we do the, the, the e-grow share and kind of what, what we have in front of us that we're going to be testing. Okay. And then we'll I, talk I, about I these guys. Yeah, we, okay, let's introduce everybody else. Yeah. So, <laughs> Darren Barney, one of our certified agriscapers, so he's here in the Gilbert area and works uh, valley-wide in the Phoenix area, one of our top guys. That's Darren. Hey guys. Then we got uh, Todd Thompson over here. He's from E. e Todd T. Design. And he's one of our top designers, our certified designers at Agriscaping. Cool. Then we got Nathan Elder. He's also one of our team. He's been working on certifications, but he also works in house with us now, too, here at Agriscaping headquarters, which we're standing in right now. <laughs> cool. All right. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so today is all about what happened when we harvest yesterday. So yesterday was harvest time one, uh, Monday. And we harvest some uh, tomato, you know, the, the yellow one with the nappy nose thing? The yellow pear tomatoes. Yeah, thank yeah. you, pear yeah. tomato. Uh, and then we have also eggplant. We had a lot of good eggplant back there. And by the way, today's the secret of how to recuperate bad eggplant. But anyway, so aged, we have tomato. Aged eggplant. <laughs> yeah. aged, bitter. Aged. aged and bitter. Well, they if you really bitter. like it, give it a nose job, see? Oh, <laughs> I want a nose like that. But anyway, um, so... So we have eggplant, we have tomato, we have oregano, right? Because yep, oregano is medicinal, and of course we have Italian sausage, uh, because well, why not? Right? So, um, so onion. So, so this is a pasta dish that can be done very easily during the summer. And what I did is I just tossed the uh, eggplant, onion, garlic. Gotta have garlic, bacon, and cheese in your kitchen. Everybody must have. Anyway, so we toss it all together with the olive oil and salt and pepper, and we cook. Uh, and I don't like cook inside the house because of the summer, right? So hot. So I put it onto the grill and roast it, and then toss it with my pasta and sprinkle with cheese. Lots of cheese. Okay, this one I had some leftover uh, Italian sausage too, so you got to do something with it, right? And we have time. Yeah, time. time. Everybody needs more time. More time, right? So what I did is we had squash. This is a Pan, pan, pan squash, and then there was one that is a green long thingy that looks like a giant cucumber, and but it's hardcore, you know, hard and that's no, it's not a zucchini. So I know my <laughs> zucchini. Uh, this one is a, a ka, kabuka. I think that's kabucha. 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 There was one we got uh, from one of my friends from India. He's one of our Fab Five families. He brought us a bunch of seeds that we're, we've been growing for him and stuff, and so we tried that out, and that's what we're. Right. And the secret there is, um, it's, this is very hard. So what you want to do is just pop it in the microwave for about two minutes for each, each thing, and it will get it softened enough so that you can cut through it easily and scoop out the inside. Yes, it means. And that's what we did. So we scoop out the inside, and then we skin it, much easier that way, and we toss it with mushroom and Italian sausage and some salt and pepper, and ready to go. Now... The secret. I have a lot of old eggplant, and they tend to be very bitter. And you can try to do everything from soaking it in salt, briny, whatever, water overnight, uh, and roast it, and, and put anything you want. But the problem is, it's still a little bit bitter. So, my guinea pig. Oh, here we go. It's Tasty Tuesday, so you guys get to taste it to see if we, if we okay. solve the challenge. Okay, so I roasted the bitter eggplant. I, I, I roasted the bitter eggplant. I Took off of the skin, right, and just had the the, the inside, and then I um uh, what do you call it? You, you drilled it with. Yeah. I want to say emulsify. Yeah. But that is not the right word. Blend or, it. Huh? Blend, blend, blend it. Thank you. Kind of. Yeah. Sure. Sure. So, it <laughs> so it becomes a sauce. Now here's the beauty of it. Have a taste. I want you guys to have a dip. Uh, dip. Now. It will still be a little bit bitter, even though we roast it, which brings a little bit less bitterness to it, right? Just a little bit less. But, hmm. anybody who has uh, tomato sauce in a can, you know it's awfully uh, sour, right? 
So if you, so to taste how, how sour, uh, typical, typical spaghetti sauce, go ahead and dip that. Okay? Now, what you're going to do is, you can marry the two together, and it becomes a mellow <laughs> sauce. Give it a try. Give it a try. Dig in, honey. Okay. See, the kids want to try, too. Yeah. All right, yeah, kids got to try, too. So yeah. they just came in with some edible flowers. You guys remember what the names of your flowers are? Which was that one? Dianthus. Dianthus. Very good, Caleb. Yeah. Chloe, what do you got there? You probably ought to bring it over here. Or have yeah. Brittany come she on over. Brittany's see. behind the screen right now. And so we got Dianthus. Behind the scenes. Yeah. What do you got there? So open it up so we can see them. Don't squish them all. We want to see them. We want to see the pretty flowers. Do you remember which one those are? Pansies. White pansies. Yep, white pansies. We kind of call them the vanilla pansies, right, Jack? Yeah. And Jack got some pansies, too. Mm -hmm. Very good. Mm -hmm. So good edible flowers. Well, we can put them on the table. You just make the table look pretty, and we'll be able to snack on them while we're eating. Cool. Very good. All right. So right. you guys want to try some of this, too? So dip it into the combination eggplant slaw slash tomato sauce. And you'll notice if it mellows it out. The beauty of this is you can make it ahead of time, put it in your freezer whenever you're ready to do any spaghetti or pizza. What's this is a nice sauce. Hmm. Put it over the pizza and again, cheese. You can't go wrong with <laughs> yeah, cheese. So go on to cheese. Bake it off. You got yourself some cool looking pizza. Tasty. Well, it doesn't huh? mellow that because that was pretty bitter. Exactly. I'm like, oh, my God. Some people are very sensitive to bitter. I've yeah. never met a vegetable I did not like. Bitter or not. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice when it's not. Right? Did yeah, you that was how, better. That was because better. that's the beauty. That's the key. You have to marry it with something sour. And I really then want to double dip, but I, I won't. Right. I won't yeah, try. Yeah. 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 Right. 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 Yeah. Oh, okay. Very good. Very good. Sacrament style. Yeah. But but that's a key. You marry it with something sour. And, and normally people think of uh, lemon juice and stuff like that, but I personally like tomatoes. Tomato sauce is better as a sour. Somehow when you, when, when you, when you cook it off, it sweetens it up better. Versus lemon, lemon juice is just going to continue to be sour. Yeah. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. So that is your Tasty Tuesday. With <laughs> nice. Thank tasty you. Tuesday with Lon. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Sign up, share. We'll see you next time.